Hey yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. So, um, I haven't recorded in a few days and so I'm going to start the vlog here or this video here. Um, it's Friday, St. Patrick's Day, and I just finished up with work. <clears throat> I've had a busy morning and my voice actually, uh, my throat is kind of hurting. I don't know why. Um, I have not been on the apple cider vinegar grind as of lately. Um, definitely pick some up if you guys you know, ever get sick often, your throat ever hurts, it really helps a lot with like sickness and also um, appetite suppressant. So I gotta get some of that soon. I'm probably gonna get some tonight. And so, <clears throat> yeah, I'm just gonna give you guys some life updates real fast. Just stuff that's been happening between videos that you guys have not seen. On Wednesday, I went to the chiropractor and uh, got adjusted a little bit. My lower back's been hurting. Um, I have a cyst in my lower back. So like right here, I think that's maybe what's causing the pain. Sometimes on leg day when I go extra heavy, uh, it really hurts a lot and then it like kind of enables me to finish the, my workout. So I um, had him adjust me a little bit and he gave me some exercises to do for that. Pretend I'm laying on the foam roller. Put your hands like this. Keep your elbows straight up in the air. Look up in the air. And then start up here and then roll slowly down um, until you hit a point of contact where like it feels extra sore. Sit on there for a while, and then uh, you want to extend back, and then kind of roll back up. So almost like a crunch, but you're just doing that to kind of release the tension. So he said do like sets of 10 right there, and then roll down, find another point, and then do all that again. So I'm doing that like every day, twice a day, and uh, feel better. So that's good. Also, what else happened? Oh, okay, so today I've been super active. You guys got to see this. So, as you can see right there, guys, I've burned a lot of calories. 1,900 calories so far today. It's only 4 p.m. That is insane. So, that is not even uh, accounting my BMR. That's just active calories. My BMR is 19, 1923 right now. Um, it changes depending on weight. As my weight goes down, my BMR is going to drop. BMR is just how many calories you burn if you were to do nothing all day. So... Um, that plus that, I'm, I'm going to burn so many calories today and it's going to be great. Um, I may eat a little more just so I'm not so far in the deficit. I don't want to lose too much weight too fast. So having something that tracks calories is also a huge way to, um, enable yourself so you don't lose weight too fast. And, uh, yeah, so stay active guys. If you really, you know, you're having a hard time losing weight or whatever you're doing, stay active and uh, stay true to your diet. That's another huge thing that I would recommend. I also had a refeed day a few days ago and I did not gain an ounce of weight, so that's good. Or I should say pound of weight. Anyways, uh, so what I did for the refeed is I had a thousand extra calories. I just ate back what I burned um, from cardio and workout and I didn't gain any anything and uh, felt a lot better the next day. So that's good. Uh, I had legs this morning. You know, it was all right. I had some knee pain in my left knee, so that kind of disabled me to squat. I stopped squatting completely. I did not want to further the injury, so I just improvised with extra sets on the leg press, hack squat, um, lunges, stuff like that, just to get a better burn. Uh, squats do take a big part of legs, just because it's a great exercise. So if you were to just knock that off, you really have to make up for it. So uh, I made up for it, and I tried my best. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much what's been going on between videos just to keep you guys all updated You're not sitting like, you know, yeah, you see my videos But maybe you don't know what goes on behind the scenes when I'm not recording so that is the, the main stuff that's happened so far Also, I got a new gallon here goes right here BPA free. I got it from Whole Foods. Um, it's blue I feel like the water tastes kind of gross in it. So, uh, that's Yeah, anyways and I got a package today in the mail, so we might as well open that up too while we're just here talking. Alright guys, here they go. Adidas Boost, as you can see. So let's open it up. I haven't even looked inside yet, so here we go. We're going to do this together. Alright, so I got a tweet and, uh, well, I'm subscribed or... 
post notifications to this account and I got a tweet saying these were restocked. So these are the Ultra Boost V3 all white. So here they go. And uh, yeah, let's just drop into a little mini uh, shoe edit just because I love shoes. Here they go on feet guys. I just spent, spent like 10 to 15 minutes lacing them up. Um, I really like them. They're super comfy. I'm going to spray them with the crepe spray and uh, two coats and then they should be good for some extreme weather. So the crepe is really good and uh, I haven't been talking to you guys in a couple days because tomorrow's my off day and I kind of just want to relax. I got to work and so Sunday I am completely free. Full day of vlog and show you guys a great workout. Alright guys, so it's currently Sunday and I'm ready for a full day of vlogging. So I stayed on my rides last night and now we're about to eat breakfast. It's 9 o'clock. We got up around 8 to 8.30ish. 8 and uh, so yeah, I'm not going to the gym fast today. I want to try eating first and then see what happens. But I'm going to show you my breakfast right now. So this is Mariah's. She eats uh, strawberries and cream. And this is mine. So here's one scoop of an isolate protein, uh, honey granola flavor and two packs of the lower sugar maple brown sugar oatmeal and I'm also gonna do a cup of this not the whole thing just like a little bit makes one cup and it's the greens powder so I mix that in the cup and show you guys the finished product alright guys so here it is it's all finished up um, here's Mariah's and here's mine you can see the volume difference this is two packs and that's two packs I like to add extra water and also there's a scoop of protein in there Mariah likes it kind of dry not so much water but they're the same amount of oatmeal packs here's my greens and here's her water you want to say hi so um, let me tell you guys one more thing before I eat because I'm super hungry I'm waiting at 177 flat today I'm super happy about that um, weights dropping my macros are being hit and uh, everything's going good. So, see you guys at the next stop. All right, next stop, guys, is back to my house. I gotta get the Sam's card for my dad. Mine expired, and I don't feel like paying 45 bucks. So, um, I just had him leave it on the counter for me. He went to church, and uh, I'm gonna go to Sam's Club. Thank you, Dad. Oh my gosh, the struggle was so real on that. I could not pick it off the ground. My nails are a little stubby. I should just cut them. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Check this out. Oh boy, fresh. Anyways, uh, see you at the Sam's Club. Alright guys, so just got here to Sam's Club. Now, before I go inside and before I start like grocery shopping, I'm gonna put uh, this on the screen right here. This is my grocery list. I forgot to put apple cider vinegar with the mother on there. So uh, just remember that. My budget is like $70. Just remember though, when you're, when you're dieting and stuff, you gotta be able to spend money. You gotta be willing to spend money to get the results. If you spend the bare minimum, you're not gonna get that good of results. 70 bucks, that's not that much. And some stuff do last me a week and a half and others just last me the week, but that's all right. 70 bucks for a week is okay with me for groceries. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go inside now and we'll get it done. <laughs> What'd you get? I got the uh, Sam's Club exclusive Purple Monster. It's a must and I forgot mine at home, so. Alright guys, so I was going to get the blackberries at the grocery store because I just never had them here and uh, swung by. They have them, so I get this for the fiber and it's actually lower in carbs, so it's a must. Alright, next. 
a mini cucumbers. This is a very low calorie. I like to do this for a snack. I usually eat like four a day. Um, there's like eight carb, four protein. So these are, these are really good too. You getting these? Yeah, I'm just trying to look for a big fat juicy one. This one looks good. Strawberries, guys. I like to mix the strawberries and the blackberries. I like to throw some flaxseed on there. These are good. But you want to find like the nice big plump ones that are not disgusting and brown. So this one looks good. All right, guys. Next is chicken tenderloin. What I was doing is I was looking for one that had the furthest expiration date and it kind of weighed the most. So then I get more chicken throughout the week. So chicken tenderloin. I like to do this instead of the breasts because they're more juicy and they cook faster. All right, guys. Next item is egg whites. This is my protein source for breakfast, and uh, if I just feel like making a cheesy omelet, so is it right here? Egg white. Last, guys, for Sam's Club is penne noodles. This is just the noodles I like to eat. Um, and I can get a big box, so this will last me like a week and a half. I actually still have a few packs at home, so it's gonna last me like two weeks. Also, Mariah is gonna get some of this flaxseed. I still have a huge bag at home. It lasts a long time, and it's good for fiber and uh, omegas. So, if you don't have it, get it. All right, we're gonna transition to the grocery right. store in three, two, one. All right, guys, so we're here at the grocery store now. First stop is gonna be oatmeal. Lower sugar oatmeal, because you save on carbs. Uh, where are we at here? There we go. We grab three boxes. That's weight control. Ugh. Next, guys, is stevia. It's a must. It sweetens the unsweetened things. And it's uh, all natural from plants. So I'm going to grab two boxes of these. <laughs> And you need that because you're not sweet. Alright, so I decided I am going to try doing the kale today. So I'm going to grab some of this kale, Italia, organic stuff. And also I'm going to grab a dressing. Yogurt dressing, it's low calorie dressing, 35 calories per serving. I'm going to try the uh, cucumber ranch, it's new, I've never tried it. So this completes the grocery haul here at the store. I'm going to go home and put this away. And then take a pre-workout for the gym. All right, guys, about to mix pre-workout here. Do like that much water. I also have a pre-workout mix. I took half a scoop from Complete. I also have creatine in here, citrulline, so and a baby scoop of beta alanine. Yeah, so since I work at a supplement shop, I can take pre-workout. But what I did is I grabbed my own creatine, my citrulline. I mixed it in the bag. I thought I was going to be taking the pre-workout Mariah's, but I uh, decided to just take it here at home. I dropped my camera when we were leaving the grocery store, like it fell on the lens. So I don't think, I don't know if it's broken or not. Like it froze for a little bit, but anyways, here's pre-workout, cheers. She gets the gym. My father told me when I was young, don't play with fire, be careful son. But we were flames and fell in love.
guys so just pull up here to the shop and I bought to get my post workout meal at the family restaurant so not everyone can get away eating like this this is if you fit your macros at its best so I'm gonna show you guys my food all right guys so I got a chicken sandwich here no extra oil on anything jalapenos mushrooms uh, tomato lettuce and then a egg bun and I also got a Philly cheesesteak um, prime rib one piece of cheese no oil on anything and a hoagie bun <laughs> seven inches so this is it, and I all logged it all. It's like 800 calories. But after this, I'll only be at like 1,100 for the day, and uh, my goal is to hit 28 every single day, and I'm gonna keep dropping weight doing that. Yeah, absolutely destroy that, and Mariah went to work, so. Man, that food was so good. I'm still super hungry though, but I'm gonna let it settle. Probably eat in a couple hours. Hit that new low weight at 177. I'm super stoked about that. I ate my last meal which was uh, a halo top and some added peanut butter to finish off my carbs and my fats. And that was it. And so I ate that at eight. And I think that helped me hit that new low weight in today so I didn't eat super late, eat too many carbs late at night. Um, so that was good. But anyways, I think that's gonna conclude the video guys. I'm gonna go home and edit this up. I got a few assignments to do, also a quiz. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoy this one. I'm pretty sure it's a longer one, but hey, hope you guys can do this during your cardio or whatever you're doing, maybe you're chilling at home. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, comment any questions if you have them, and I'll see you guys in the next one.